just heading out today to our little picnic area which is in the Nosley State Forest just a little trip today a little picnic area that's near Lake Epilock that you can sort of have a barbecue and relax and while you're out maybe a day fishing or something like that you can go there and have another little spot let the kids run around do a bit of yabbing or something we're just heading out up past the spillway which is a uh, We've done a thing on the spillway before, we just have to go over the spillway and then take a left into a, what's called Quarry Road, which is, is just the start of Nosley State Forest. Probably about two or three k's from the spillway and you go down Axdale Quarry Road. And um, we're heading into, I hope you can see that, that's Nosley State Forest, so that's a part of Nosley State Forest in there. Quite a nice little ride through here. It's a little bit hilly, but you can oversee or see over um, towards Bendigo. Gets a nice little little hilly little spot. You hang a right at the quarry, and it takes you to a a track over here, which you can sort of see. It's sort of a big open space, and then it goes to a track. Yeah, so a track down here and um, crosses the O'Keefe Rail Trail, which is strictly not for motorbikes, it's for walking track or, or push bikes. So we go down to, this is called Smart Picnic Road, or track rather, Smart Picnic Track. Um, and we go down here and, and get to Smart Picnic Area. Just coming up on it now. Smart Track Picnic area. It's about seven kilometres from the spillway at Ipperlock. Smart Track Picnic area in your state forest. It's another little trip we've brought you on to have a look around the Bendigo area or any other area we can do. This is thank you from uh, Road to Discovery. So we'll do a few more so you can have a bit of a look around if we find anything else. So smart track picnic area, what a great little place but take your rubbish home because I don't understand why people don't take their rubbish home. So we're just getting a little fire going, we'll put a, a cupper on and we'll do something for, for lunch. So we've got a cup of tea, now what we've done today, we're going to have a bit of a cook up, I'll put in a, some bacon, we'll cook that up, I'll put in a a bomb of butter <laughs> and a bomb of uh, dead horse or tomato sauce. Put in a jar I've made up some pancake mix. It's uh, just an old. So in goes the uh, the bomb of butter or mar There we go. We've got the bacon in there sizzling away. Beautiful. We'll cook him up. Get him a little bit crispy. Okay, so I'm not sure how this is going to go, so I've taken a few bits of bacon out. We'll tip some of this mixture in there on the on the bits of, on the bacon. Make our first pancake and see what happens. Well, we definitely haven't perfected it yet, but it's starting to look like a bacon pancake. So there's the bacon pancake. I think that came out pretty damn good on the fire there and the little pan so that's a first for road to discovery what we'll do is just chuck a bit of the uh, sauce bomb on here as you can see we've used a bit of water out of the dam that's not a bad idea if you've got a pot or a bottle put the fire completely out before you leave not only that don't leave any rubbish take it home with you it's not a big problem Anyway, that's Road to Discovery again. We've had our bacon pancakes. We've had a cup of tea. We've had a bit of a ride and come out and shown you a smart track picnic area. Thanks for watching. Be safe.